time home! Oh. I've actually been home for about two weeks now. In this video, I'll be showing you what I did during my first week and also introducing you guys some of my really good friends. Because these are people I consider to be family and you guys are kind of like my family too. Feels unreal to be back in my room. Look at these walls. Don't they seem so familiar to you guys? Anyways, the first thing I have to do is of course get some food and eat it at a staircase like how I used to in high school. It actually just tastes like soy. I also got to do something I haven't done in the past year, which is making bracelets. It complements the other two bracelets very well, like a pink theme. If you guys want a tutorial, I will be filming one because I posted this on Instagram and so many people have been asking for a tutorial. So I'm gonna go have dinner with my friend Clover, so let's go. <laughs> this is Clover. I recognize her from my previous videos. <laughs> She's here for the summer. It's actually so cool to see her in Taipei. I brought her to Ili Pao which I used to have all the time in high school. Show the camera. This is Audrey, Loon, and Adrian. If you're wondering why they look familiar, they were in my literature video. We all study in different countries, so we get to see each other max two times a year. But we still remain close, which I'm so, so grateful for. <laughs> Adrian actually came to visit me in London with her mom in March during my most miserable times in London. Adrian, if you're watching this, thank you. This is Aline, who's also in my Lucius Sun video. She said he's in Korea. Oh, he's really very strong on me. Don't tie it. Don't tie it. This is Alyssa. She's Adri's twin. We've all been friends since high school. Let's do a haul of everything my Omni got me. She literally swallows me every single time. Matcha cookies, mascara. Yeah, I like the tube, it's pink. Cleansing balm. Socks. This one is like um, a matching one with her. Thank you, Omni! I love everything. I'm not sure if I've told you guys this, but I'm going to Japan at the end of August, I think. A while ago, when I was still in London, I met some racists at Oxford Street. I was out with friends, some white middle-aged dude yelled a very racist term at us. From that starts with C. I did what any normal human being would do. Turned to him. I yelled very loudly, "Shut up, you racist!" I felt so good after saying it. Like I don't think I've ever said anything and felt this good afterwards. Some racist people really target young Asian girls like me because they assume we can't fight back. Just like. First of all, so messed up. Second of all, so pathetic of them. So now, but hold up, it's Come on. <laughs> this is Sabrina. We've been friends since middle school. We really don't get to see each other a lot. We still update each other on our lives, and that's how we remain close. Alright, this is Erica. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably see me post her all the time. That's fifty percent of the time I'm out. It's with her. Spoiler alert. I'm really bad at riding bikes. Wow, it's 
小心车，不要骑脚踏车，超舒服的。然后都来了公馆，怎么可能不吃东西？在吃水煎包，感觉快被我吃完了，但真的很好吃。哈哈哈哈哈。那你是来的？好了，哎，走开去，我抓。我要看地图。哦，好了，我到地球。哎，很漂亮，很漂亮。好，我要开始弄你。哦，你 got the same earrings， 嘿嘿嘿。